Well, hello and welcome to all of my wonderful foundation students. I hope you guys are really well today. Today, you guys, we are going to be reading some music symbols. And you can see on the screen there, it says foundation. It's time to read music. I'm very excited. What I'm also really excited about is we're going to be making some instruments. So today we're going to be making a shaker and I'll talk to you about that in a second. And then next week we're going to be getting some sticks, some clap sticks and playing some music with those things. So I'm super duper duper excited today. Let's get started. The first thing you guys need to do is you need to make your own instrument. Now, you would have been sent some information and hopefully mum or dad or a special person have gone through that with you and you've got your instrument ready to play. If you haven't done that, let's do a little bit of reading and you guys do a bit of uh, listening and then you might have to pause the video and then go off and make your instrument and then come back and restart, okay? So let's have a look at what's on the board. Instruments. It's time to make your own instrument. Shakers, I love shakers. I love shaking as well. Okay, now have a look down the bottom, you guys, and mums and dads and special people might read through this with you. These are the things that you can use for your shakers today. A plastic bottle or container filled with shaky stuff. Now, shaky stuff, you know, the best shaky stuff I've found is rice. If you haven't got any rice around your house, maybe have a look for some other things like rice, okay? So you could use maybe paper clips or something small like that, but be really careful what you use and always ask mum and dad or an adult uh, for some help, okay? You've also got uh, a choice of a tin filled with shaky stuff. So if, it's, if you've got a tin, they sound really good, but make sure it's got a lid and be really careful that the lid doesn't come off when you're shaking uh, during the song, okay? You could use a glass jar filled with shaky stuff, but again, be really, really careful. A plastic bottle, container, or a tin is better than the glass jar. So that's kind of like if you can't find anything else, okay? And if you've just gone through all of that stuff, gone through your house, can't find anything like that, what about a toilet roll? I'm sure you've got a toilet roll hanging around somewhere. Sealed at both ends so you could get some masking tape and, and put on one end, fill it with some shaky stuff, and then seal it with, on the other end. And then voila, you've got yourself a shaker, okay? So I'm sure you guys will be able to find a shaker somewhere uh, in your house to, uh, to put together for this lesson. If you haven't got your shakers ready, why don't you pause the video now and then go off, get your instrument ready, come back and play the video again. If you are ready, let's go. All right, shakers, have a look at my shaker. I've got a plastic bottle, okay, or a plastic jar, whatever you want to call it, container filled with shaky stuff, which is rice, okay? Have a listen to it. I reckon that sounds really, really good, okay? So you guys might have something similar to that today. Okay, so if you've got your shakers ready, excellent. Let's shake them. Shake your shakers, foundation. My shakers sound like a rattlesnake. What do your shakers sound like? Shake them again. Let's hear them. Wow, they sound amazing, you guys. Well done. All right, shake your shakers up high. Oh, my arm's sore. I better bring it down again. Shake your shakers down low. Shake your, shake your shakers from side to side. Well done, you guys. Shake your shakers fast. Whew, that was exhausting. Shake your shakers slow. Wow, that was a good rhythm. Let's do that one again. Listen to my rhythm. 
Wow, I'm really happy with my homemade shaker. Shake your shakers loud. I wonder what's next. Shake your shakers soft. What a great sound. Shake your shakers making a circle. One more time around, guys. Okay, well done, foundation. Shake your shakers making a square. Well, this is going to be tricky. So we're going to go straight up, straight across, straight down, straight back. One more time. Straight up, straight across, straight down, straight back. Okay, how did you guys go? Excellent. Okay, now up on the screen there, you can see rhythm one. And I've got four symbols there. So you can see four lots of shakers. I wonder if you guys can work out how our rhythm's going to go. Why don't you have a quick look and see if you can work out how that rhythm's going to go? Have you worked it out yet? Okay. You might have thought, well, <clears throat> Mr. Bartlett, if there's four lots of shakers, maybe I just play my shaker four times. If you thought that, you are ching ching correct. Okay, so this rhythm is just one, two, three, four. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to count one, two, ready, go, and then together we are going to play rhythm number one. <clears throat> Excuse me, I've got a frog in my throat and his name's Bill. <clears throat> okay, are you ready? One, two, ready, go. Shake, 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 stop. Okay, so there were four beats there making up our first rhythm. Well done, you guys. Let's have a look at our next rhythm. Rhythm two. Okay, so that's pretty simple. We've just doubled the amount of beats. So we've got not four, but how many? Let's count them together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is that correct? Well, oh, why are people yelling out eight? Oh, because there's eight, Mr. Bartlett. Okay, so there, there are eight shaker symbols there. So we're going to play rhythm two, and it has eight shakers. Okay, so here we go. One, two, ready, go. One, two, three, four five six seven stop did you guys all stop when i said stop great work team well done let's have a look at rhythm number three. Oh, it's getting tricky okay so we've got three lots of four shakes okay i'm going to count them you count with me you guys so we are playing how many times one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven 12 okay so 12 shakes for rhythm number three here we go team after four one two ready go is what i'm going to say one two ready go stop and hopefully you guys stopped with me on beat number 12 well done so that was a really good warm-up Rhythm one, rhythm two, and rhythm three. We might go back to them a bit later on. Now, <clears throat> now it's time for some call and response. I know I've done this with some of you guys before, but there might be some people watching today that don't know what call and response is. So if you have a look there, it says, listen to Mr. Bartlett's rhythm and repeat using your shakers, okay? So I might play this rhythm and you would then repeat it back to me. So I call and you guys respond, okay? So I'm gonna play that rhythm again, and then straight afterwards, I want you guys to play it back with your beautiful shakers, okay? Here we go, you guys, waiting for Mr. Bartlett. So this is Mr. Bartlett. One, two, ready, Mr. Bartlett, go. Play. Okay, did you guys play the same rhythm as me? Excellent. Let's try it one more time. Same rhythm, you guys. 
So then after that, I'm going to keep on going with some other new rhythms. So you need to have your best listening ears on for this one. Here we go. Mr. Bartlett starts. You guys respond. Then me, then you. I think you get it now. Here we go. One, two, Mr. Bartlett play. Wow, I think you guys did a great job with that one. Well done, everybody. Okay, so that was some call and response. And next week, with our new instruments that we'll be making next week, uh, we're going to do some more call and response. Let's keep moving. Okay, let's try rhythm one again. Now, we are professional rhythm players now, so this one will be really simple, you guys. Okay, so let's try rhythm number one. One, two, ready, go. One, two, three. Four. Okay, you guessed it. Rhythm number two is next, and there were eight beats in rhythm number two. One, two, ready, play. One, two, three. Okay, and then rhythm number three, that was the one with how many? We had four, then we had eight, now we've got 12. Okay, here we go. One, two, ready, play. Okay, well done, you guys. I can hear some great shaking going on there. Okay, now here comes the tricky bit. We are going to be doing some new rhythms with some rests. And rests are where we simply don't play for one beat or two beats or three beats, whatever. Okay, let's have a look at what we have. Okay, so this symbol means rest for one beat. So when you see that symbol, that person's hand up to their lips, it means don't play. Let's practice doing this, you guys. Ready? One more time. Okay, so that means don't play for one beat. Let's have a look at our first rhythm with our first rest. I'm pretty excited. Okay, rhythm one with rhythm one with rests. That's a bit of a tongue twister, isn't it? So I'm a bit confused. I wonder whether you guys can work out what to do here. We've got three shakers and then the sh. So what does that mean? How would that go, you guys? Do you reckon you guys might want to give it a go? Okay, I'll count four beats. So you play those three beats and then do this at the end. Okay, one, two, you guys go. Okay, some of you guys did a really good job. Okay, I think I might give it a go now. So I think it goes shake once, shake twice, shake three times, then. Was I right? I thought so. Okay, so this is our first rhythm with rests. One, two, three. Okay, could you guys hear anything on the fourth beat? No, because there's a rest. Okay, so together, you guys, let's do rhythm one with rests. Here we go. One, two, ready, play. Shake, shake, shake. Okay, how'd you go, you guys? Excellent work. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me, that frog's still there. Okay, rhythm number two with rests. Okay, so we've got two rests at the end and two shakes at the beginning. So that must be shake, shake. That must be how that one goes. Am I correct? Of course I am, you guys. Mr. Butler's always correct. Okay, let's try it. So we have shake, shake. Okay, now you can still hear me going. And if you're listening really, really carefully, you might hear my foot on the chair. Okay, that's showing that we've still got those beats there, but we're silent. Okay, so they're silent beats. Okay, let's try rhythm number two with rests. 
One, two, ready, go. How did you guys go? Great work, team. Okay. Our last one, rhythm three with wrists, is really simple because we only play once and then we've got one, two, three wrists. Okay, so three beats of silence after, after we play once with our shaker. So it's easy. We don't even need to practice it, you guys. We are all over this. Here we go. Rhythm three with wrists. One, two, ready, go. Did you guys get it right? Okay, well done, you guys. Now, listen, if you didn't get it right today, you know what? You can rewind the video and have another play with it. Uh, and don't worry, because as long as you gave it your best shot, that's the main thing. Great job, you guys. Now we are going to play a song with our shakers. So we've got another video coming up where we're going to play a really, really cool song. We're going to have some fun with it. And uh, you guys better get your shakers ready. It's coming straight up right now. All right, Foundation, if you got your shakers ready, let's rock and roll. That was really hard work. Hey, you guys, I hope you had a great time today. <laughs> I hope you had a great time today with music with Mr. Bartlett. I certainly had a great time today. I'm going to go and have a little lie down. See you guys next time. Bye.